Thank you, presiding officer. Uh, not thanking Liam for taking an extra three or four seconds there for me, though. But I take this debate extremely seriously, presiding officer. Higher education and the Scottish Government's commitment to higher education is one of the foundations of our future, creating the type of Scotland we all want, looking forward, ensuring that our young people have the future that we all want them to have. I take this issue very seriously. However, I do not have the same thoughts with regards to the Labour Party and their antics within this chamber on this issue. And on this issue. Like the Cabinet Secretary, I also thank the Labour Party for bringing this debate, though, because it gives us an opportunity to tell everyone exactly what the Scottish Government is doing in higher education. And I think you have to, when you're talking, when Hugh Henry mentioned about the fact of parroting, we're all parroting the same thing. Well, he must be talking about Robin Parker then. He must be talking about the NUS because they're agreeing with us about the investment that the Scottish Government are making and how it has to happen and how the post-16 reform bill has to go through. And that's one of the things I have to I ask myself when I think what the Labour Party are currently doing. You know, they say they believe in widening access. They spend time here, and Mr Finlay's nodding his head uh, vigorously about that. They say they want to do that. But then when they get an opportunity to vote upon it in the committee, they vote against it. And then they come in here and they do a bit of showbiz in front of the media and they don't actually do anything with regards to the people uh, that actually count, which is the students. Well, for me, presiding officer, I don't have the time. I'm sorry, I don't have the time at the moment. Presiding officer, for me, the most important thing is the students and the offer that we have. Like, even today, it's already been mentioned earlier that uh, in the Scotsman's article, NUS Scotland President Robin Parker said, our research shows that the student hardships and not having enough money to live on is one of the largest deterrents to starting and staying in college. That's why it's so important to see the huge investment being made in financial support of £140 million per year. This shows the commitment of this government and Scotland and the NUS appreciate this as well. That's the difference between the Scottish Government and the Labour Party. Mm -hmm. The Labour Party, and I mean this kindly, and I want to say this gently, because I am, do believe in consensual politics and is all working together on things, but I would like to actually say to them, you know, please let the Labour Party not become some sideshow in a carnival and actually work with us and engage in the future and try and build the type of Scotland we want, move away from the Saturday night variety performance and actually do something for Scotland's future. Now, President Officer, this is Order. about the future. And for me, the future is about ensuring that Order. we can create the type of Scotland that we want for our younger people in Scotland. And this will not be achieved by the Labour Party's current antics. Thank you very much. That